A staple gym in downtown Sarasota is closing its doors for good at the end of the month. SNN's Lyndon Blake has details on why the facility is shutting down. Work out at the downtown Sarasota YMCA? Not anymore after October 7th. Michael Cradlack joined the gym in the 90s when it first opened. He says the location is everything. I actually work two blocks from here, so it's extremely convenient. I come here every day for lunch, so I'm extremely disappointed that I won't be able to make it my lunchtime routine every day. Interim CEO Steve Bourne says the Sarasota YMCA was forced to close the Babe Weiler branch because rent was too high. You know, the downtown branch has been here for 25 years plus, and so this is, this is a, a sad day. Bourne says the worst part is seeing members' faces when they read about the closing. A lot of people are in shock because it's actually happened. Cradlack says he enjoyed the gym because of the family atmosphere. They make you feel uh, at home, comfortable, friendly. Everybody's really great. Many people I recognize their faces, even if I don't know their names. It's like, oh, so and so is here, or that guy's here, or that lady's here working out. So it feels like a community, even though you don't always necessarily know people's names or, or what their story is, you know. Members have been told to use the Berlin branch off Bay of Vista. Bourne says he he hopes they choose to stay with the YMCA. The Berlin branch is absolutely, it's newly renovated. It's only a mile and a half from here and uh, has a lot more amenities. The CEO says closing the downtown location isn't a setback. He says YMCA has bigger plans for the future. Our hope is that we will build a branch on the east side over by 75 at some stage of the game. But for Cradlock, a new YMCA just won't be the same. It's not this gym. This gym has a special feel. There's a lot of great classes. It's just a great place. Reporting in Sarasota, Lyndon Blake, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. We're told all the staff from the downtown Y are transferring to the Berlin branch off Euclid. Well, still ahead, the cases of Zika in Florida are holding steady for now. We'll have the latest on the outbreak when we come back. Stay with us.